So as I said, uh, I did a little bit of farming. So the staff, the Trina sword and the Moonlight are all fully upgraded. <laughs> so we can't be better than this. Except with the buffs. Also, I'm really looking forward to using the Moonlight because in Bloodborne it was my favorite, aesthetically wise, and also because you get it from Ludwig, which is a really cool character and all. And um, we need uh, an extra helping hand uh, that will be super useful against uh, Maliketh. <laughs> Because I keep thinking ahead of the latest boss of the game, while we are not even halfway yet. So, to my right. Oh yeah, Adula is still alive though. Mm. Adula gives a hundred thousand runes. Okay, if, uh, if we beat a T, we'll come back to her, instead of killing innocents <laughs> that did nothing wrong. Also, I want to show you the buff uh, of the Moonlight, uh, which uh, apparently we weren't meeting the requirements before, when we had uh, 10 strength. We needed 12. Uh, to be able to chew hand it. So basically we had a, a useless weapon that is very strong in our inventory until now, which only took a couple of hours of going back and forth in the Halig tree. Very entertaining to see me fall over and over. Oh well. Okay, attempt number three. Should I buff before we start the fight? Yeah, that will be smart. Mm -hmm. And it looks like this. It's so pretty. She still hits like a truck. Okay, I need to manage my stamina instead of rolling randomly. And I think we did 200 damage. I mean, we could also try to use this stuff. A fully upgraded stuff. Also, hi Kudalia, how are you doing? Also, I really like T, I don't want to finish the game without her. some damage okay but no panic rolling please okay at least now I know it's doable <laughs> as long as I don't panic roll the moonlight is so cool It truly was by my side, all along. Mm. Also, if I remember correctly, running is more effective in this arena.
stamina. Also, hi, Dr. Farmer. Stamina. Okay. Oof. Maybe I should use an item that makes it to replenish faster. But I don't know how it's called. <laughs> because in every game there is one, right? Kind of like a, a grass shield of sorts. Even if there is, I don't think I have it. Hmm. What even here are, are these items? All oh, right, the, we never use the the status buff. So. Oh well. I still keep enjoying the vanilla version of the game without all of the extra stuff. Nice touch, darling. <laughs> yeah. If the buff didn't end mid attack, it would have ended differently. Also, hi Wolverine. We'll get her. It's uh, a tough uh, warm up, but at least now I know it's doable. <laughs> That's all it matters. It's not a heavy weapon? Oh god. The Moonlight is not a heavy weapon.
96. Whew. I didn't know Star Wars was keeping making games. I used to play one in the past, but it was a long time ago. We might not need to kill the dragon if uh, 96 uh, is enough to fully upgrade her. Which we do have the materials for because uh, someone has been farming. <laughs> I at least I hope so. Greetings. Are you here for spirit? I, I don't have her equipped. <laughs> Greetings, are you here for spin? Ta da! Fully upgraded tea, and we got twenty K to spare. Well, not that we need to buy anything, I think. So we can go back to the Halic tree. Or to the giant. I'm more intrigued by the Halic tree today. I still want to get to Farumazula. Maybe. Hmm. Well, technically we can do both, but which one do you want to do first? Giant or tree? Because I feel like we can fit both, but the first one will have a priority. Tree first, we go to Melania, pay her a visit and then book it. Okay, so millennia it is. <clears throat> oh, I got the wrong checkpoint, didn't I? Yeah, I was meant to go to the one with the elevator. <laughs> also, just to be sure, I want to put uh, the infinite mana thing uh, because uh, I'm not sure if we can cast uh, T. Well, I mean, we can check. We can check. She requires uh, 132 FP, and we have. 173, we don't need the infinite... Uh... Oh, we don't need it. So I can keep the health regeneration instead. That is marvelous. So yeah, health regenerations and extra intelligence. Good, good, good. I'm very pleased. Also, let's uh, duplicate Loretta because she has uh, 300 uh, runes. Mages are smart. We are the living proof that they aren't. We still need to not get uh, one shot. That could be a problem. 
Yeah, definitely. Did he just interrupt her? Second phase. she heal? Nice. Also, this is the infamous checkpoint that makes the game crash if you teleport here from Hali, from Daltus Plateau. Also, I will level up my family just in case. <laughs> mm. Yeah, 40 is a good number. Although the temptation to go for intelligence again, but I know, I know the next areas are gonna be tougher, so having more vitality means uh, we'll have a smoother time. It's okay to be a coward sometimes. Hehe, <laughs> they look like his legs. <laughs> Okay, if we ever get to the pillar, I will use it on that. Also, it was very lucky that I got invaded by Anastasia while I was farming and she dropped uh, a white uh, ancient uh, smithy stone. I didn't know it was a thing. I don't even know if you need to meet her previous versions to get that one. Probably not. Thank you for the damage check. Yeah, we we are doing okay. We are doing okay. Okay, so to get to Melania, what was the fastest path? I think I missed the door. Okay, and the branch. Oh, 
Oh, this was for an item? I thought... Uh, Ah, but we can jump on the bridge. Yeah, the creature is gone. Huh. Now I know this area like uh, super well. <laughs> oh boy. I hope you feel better soon. Antibiotics can be pretty rough. Uh, I'm lost again. <laughs> I'm glad the streams are chill enough to entertain you. Like, uh, <laughs> I'm just glad. <laughs> like, until five minutes ago, I was like, oh yeah, I know this place so good, and now I'm lost. <laughs> I don't want to jump down because I know it's a shithole down there. Mm -hmm. Maybe it will come out soon. Well, fall. Maybe summer if we are lucky. Where am I? I'm in the church. This is gonna be a seed. We can't do Poopman's quest anyway. Mm -mm. And I still ended up on the lower floor. Which I didn't want to be here. I absolutely didn't want to be here. Get the stairs! No! The extra vitality didn't do anything. <clears throat> At least now we know where we need not to go. So the tower is not the answer. That was the path to get the item. Dear Lord. I don't want to explore, I want to get to Melania! Leave me alone! Ugh. Yeah, I was, I was about to say we are under fire, but that's the main path. Not the little guard! Duh. I can get past a tree creature, but not a guard. <laughs> in Elden Ring, runes aren't happiness, it's a curse. Like, I was talking about it in the, uh, in the intro. Like, Elden Ring uh, is uh, a fountain of happiness, but also a lot of unhappiness in certain regards. And my brain is like... A... I can't comprehend it. I don't compute well with the love-hate uh, feeling. At least uh, the love prevails. I was supposed to go up. How do I get up? Or maybe I need to get down to be able to go up. No. Yes. Stairs. I Stupid eggs. Stairs. I don't 
don't want to fight with the guards. I still have to see the movie, but I want to. I heard it's pretty good. Also with the singing of Jack Black, it has to be good. I remember him from the School of Rock. We didn't find this the other time. Ooh. What are you guys guarding? I want it. Ooh. Ooh. Oh yeah, we have uh, three new items to read uh, because I forgot. It was a shield, uh, this sword that we just found, uh, and something else. So why do I have arrows? Get out of here. Um. Okay, the shield was this one. A great stone shield with intricate carved fingerprints design. One of the heaviest of the great shields. Part of the tomb of an ancient god, the readerless fingers relayed their message through these imprints said to be the very seed from which Frenzy first sprouted. I know this shield, it's the one of the... the wall build, where you get uh, the armor from the tanky dude and two of these. <laughs> Damn. It's a very hard to reach location too. Then we got... Uh... Oh, okay. Mm. Oh, this! The Gleanstone Chris. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice chocolate! Uh, Ritual Blade once presented in Lando. Oh yeah, it was the gift from Renala. To Renala from Radagon. Rotten Crystal Sword. Pure crystal, a deed impossible for a human. Festers with scarlet rot. And the third thing... Um, okay. No. No. No? <laughs> I don't remember uh, what was the third uh, sword. They are the same. This is the one we just found. I don't think we'll reach a 20 faith in this run. <laughs> no. No faith, only intelligence. Hmm? Oh, good. Okay, the sewers should be pretty straightforward. Uh, like, uh, we just need to descend uh, to the very arena. And still, they could have put uh, a talisman like the cat one that actually works. 
But no. I can't run in the soup. And the build-up continues because it's stained on my clothes. Oh, you know what we could do? Okay, let me be in a safe location. Quick. That didn't do shit. Oh, no, no, the build-up is going down because I cleaned up my clothes. Also, look at those eyes. Damn, some. Also, I knew there was a grace, but I wanted to use this soap. Here we need uh... Okay, I know this is the path forward, but we are going back in the city. Oh, because we need to enter the church, that one over there. Okay, now I remember at least. The church filled with a lot of uh, really awful people. Like we could enter from there, we don't need to go all the way up. I know there is a very good reward in the chest, but we already did uh, the collection achievements, so I don't want to bother. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> Why? <laughs> hmm. I'm pretty excited to hear Melania's theme again. I didn't get the chance to fully listen to it. If uh, we can get to her, that is. Oh, please. I still don't know what's going to happen once we get to the mountains. Since now Melina hates us. Good riddance. Okay, <laughs> we are here. Again. <laughs> And I, I kind of really want uh, her rune. But before we take it seriously, can we play a little with her? 
with parries, uh, with stuff like that. Hmm. I think we can tank only a single attack, maybe two. But she can easily three shot us with the current build we have. So, are you ready to meet the lady that made so many people angry? Let's go! I dreamt for so long. My flesh was dull gold, and my blood rotted. Corpse after corpse left in my wake. As I awaited his return. Never known defeat. Okay, I'm ready. Oh boy, I forgot she needs three for every post. <laughs> Still better than one. So yeah, the first attempts are not serious. Mid animation. Late. Late. I also want a cape like that.
Well, I wasn't expecting a kick. least one repost and then we can take the fight seriously. Also I need to remember her moveset because she has a grab, she has a, a couple of lunges. Enough, enough with the kicking. I can't parry attacks that don't have a sword in them. <laughs> Rude. She just needs to do the same attack three times in a row. I didn't even check how much damage my sword does. Also, she's a, she's the reason I want to play Bloodborne again because uh, her rune is basically the rally system. Please, lady, I just want a single parry. Is that too much to ask? Nice to kick. Okay, maybe we can leave the Paris to a different kind of enemy with similar... Mm. I'm not even sure if the 6 and 7 flasks uh, are well assigned. 
Maybe it should be the opposite, 7 and 6. Hmm. Take that, Joshua. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I was distracted by the fact uh, that fake Joshua also buffed his weapon. Can they do that? <laughs> Someone's can can use... Okay. Would it be mean to defeat her already? Perhaps. Oh no. I keep forgetting. Only one of us can survive the flow, and that one isn't me. <laughs> uh. I forgot about the luck factor in this fight. Take that, Joshua. I didn't give him any healing spells. He's gonna die. Well, that was unfair. I am Melania, Blade of Mikola. Okay, she's just showing off now. <laughs> you didn't give me the repos. Because the terrain was not even. Like, I usually don't complain about bosses, uh, but I complain often about arenas. Some arenas are just stupid uh, for repost.
Oh no, line shot. Sometimes I have to step in or he will die. Forgot about a thing. <laughs> I forgot about the explosion. <laughs> To, to forget <laughs> and yeah there is no way to dodge that for me you can only tank it once to give some healing spells to him because I don't use them but he does sometimes because he's smart uh, we haven't used the cannon in a while eh. a little heal or 38 faith what are we talking about and the bestial one instead uh, of the comet. So at least he has a chance to cast. Because fake Joshua is smart. 
sometimes. He got grabbed. <laughs> sure if I actually want to beat her because with a few more attempts we can it will be cool to have her rune also this is not one of those fights where you want to duplicate the rune it's just not gonna happen Can we not fight in the lake? Joshua. He casted a healing spell on himself. Twice. This is rough. We started taking too much damage at the end uh, and with two... Wait, hold on. We need to do a bit of a flask uh, reassignment. Take that. Joshua, go! Marvelous job, Joshua. Oof. 
now she she needs to hit me instead of him and I need to not get get gotten up by the blast we got gotten by the blast <laughs> Because it's a two combo attack, the plunge and the explosion. I can only tank one. Can I? Now I'm starting to have doubts. Me. I wonder what kind of resistances uh, ashes have. Hmm. Also, if he wants to cast, uh, he can. I will not go in one-handed because of that. Or maybe I should try T instead. But it's not, it's not as fun. Here again, uh, bubble and run. It's it's not doable. We don't have enough life to tank the explosion. change one thing mm. how is a crab better than a prawn that doesn't make sense. Like getting to the second phase, a piece of cake. Surviving the very first attack of the second phase. Um. <laughs> She chose me, of course. Of 
This is definitely not the kind of fight where you want to waste the runes. Although getting hurts could be pretty nice. I want to try T for once. If the change is a uh, substantial. I'm thinking of uh, item management. Because if I use the bubble before we go in second phase, I have the extra frames uh, to run away. And also the crab, prone, whatever that is. Also, T does a lot of damage. Okay, the trick uh, is to jump towards her, but then the camera changes uh, and you need to keep uh, going forward uh, no matter where you are looking at. I'm still very confused about the second phase. Also, once you apply the cold, it can't be applied anymore. So it's a single burst. It's a bit of a shame we missed the hat. early to think uh, of the items. Oh, 
I have to say Joshua was way better at taking her aggro because T T is a very ranged uh, character. I think this is a fight of the Joshuas. Mm, let's give it another couple of attempts and then we go to the giant. Precision aiming. I think she only wants me. Like for some reason I can't get her aggro off me. Maybe it's the major stress. They grab, they grab. That was a mistake on my side. I didn't protect him. I understand now how to dodge that, but it's very... Oof. Precise. two seconds away from going to take the god skin pillar and come back because that weapon is a beast that weapon is the weapon so do we even have the upgrading materials for that 20 12 we need some stones level 3 which we can all buy Oh, don't you worry, Melania, we'll be back. Mm. 
Let's go do something easier instead. At the Church of Repost. I don't think we'll need uh, 10 flasks uh, for the giant, uh, but just to be sure. God. The good luck sip. I remembered I didn't change back the flask. And also, maybe... <laughs> Alexander exploded. Maybe I should switch back to magic for this one. I don't think we'll need more than six flasks. So... Oh, I removed the damage. I thought I changed the regeneration one. Okay. Uh. Did I really have to put a bird uh, in front of the boss fight? Alexander moral support. the ball.
I know the ball of fire can one shot me. I don't remember anything about this fight. Mood. They explode. Oh, God. He's going to roll. It's amazing how his first phase is extremely difficult uh, and every time we manage to get to the second phase uh, first try. The rolls are always pretty scary though. <laughs> Yeah, but now what is going to happen? Melina hates us. Who's gonna be there? Hieta? What if you don't do Hieta's quest? Do we burn alive? Who's gonna sacrifice then? I know my, my questions will be answered in two minutes, but... Uh, <laughs> Imagine if Melina still shows up and she's like, well, 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 look who hasn't given up the flame of frenzy yet. Do you want to atone your sins in Fire Missoula? Well, well. What do we level up? Yeah. 
Listen to the sound of flame. What does it mean? I don't remember the screaming from the other ending, like it was a lot more pacific. <laughs> but this is way much cooler. And at least it makes sense. Because the furnace is the portal to Farmazula. It still doesn't explain how we get teleported on a bridge specifically, but maybe there used to be an actual bridge, like Kanehurst. This ending makes so much more sense than the good one. <laughs> Also, I missed, I missed uh, Farmazola. does a whole lot of nothing. The creatures of this land are smart enough to dodge the bullets. Unfortunate. Hm. We need 69 for a level. Hm. Also, for some odd reason, I thought uh, 
that I had to repair my weapon so? It's the first time that I think something like that. I did. Hmm. I need to pay a little more attention to these roofs. So. Yeah, I need to pay attention and they skip uh, half a map. Uh, brain rot. Speed run brain rot. I wanted to look at the arena. I wasn't going to jump in. Of course. Because I know that there is a way to circumnavigate it. In theory. is how do I get there? How do I circumnavigate the arena from the outside? Oh? More roofs. How do I get there? I didn't notice the path below that somehow leads into the tornado. Oh, ah. hey, ice and fire. Mm-hmm. 
that's presumably death. I don't think I can tank a, a fall like this. Because I need to think it that way. There is uh, the forward uh, that it's not uh, available because the Godskin Duo is a uh, obligatory boss. Uh, but the arena has three entrances, uh, except for the exit. So how do I reach the other entrance? It's on the same side where we already are, to the right. Uh, but it's past uh, the wall. But this can't be it. Oh. That didn't go as intended. Now we can see the bridge. We can see the path forward, which we are not allowed to go yet. How many guards there is? Okay, so can I jump down then? If I die, I'm gonna be pretty annoyed. Okay. Oh. I may have done a mistake. Yeah, but this is not where I wanted to be. <laughs> I need to be across there. Not there, not here. On the second entrance to the right. Not here. <laughs> Mm. Oh. Okay, this is safe. I don't want to enter the arena by accident. <laughs> like, how do I get on the other side?
Like the entrance is exactly here, but on the floor below. I don't understand. Okay, if I fall down, I corner myself again. Why am I having so much trouble to find uh, the path? And I know this is not the right entrance because the summoning pool is not here. How do I find it? We weren't supposed to enter from here. I mean... We need to access uh, from a completely different spawn point, uh, and that this uh, is the. I don't want to enter the arena by accident. This is the commoner entrance. Uh, the those who want to die enter from here. So how do I enter from the side of, of those that don't want to die? I never noticed the other entrance. Also, I know that stepping in doesn't automatically start the fight. But I don't want to make the gates appear. Mm. Because after all, it's a pretty cool arena. Can't even see the door. How can I reach a location I don't see? On the left, uh, there is the exit, the two basic entrances. I think it has to do something with there, but how do I get there? It's like on the floor above, but down here. Part of me will just like to, to jump. There is a middle ground though. 
Yan. Hmm. I think it has to be taken very, very broadly. But how do I reach that part? Okay, since uh, it's five and a half, uh, I would suggest uh, a quick break uh, to get more water. And I will try to figure out how to get to the entrance we want. Uh. Because I keep looking at the map, uh, but it's not saying anything. Uh. So yeah, give me five, uh, ten minutes uh, and I will be right back. And we are back. Also, hi Afro! Tried to get for times the nice emote and got the awkward one. <laughs> awkward. But yeah. Maybe you could subscribe and get them all. Haha. -ha. But uh, I know where we need to go now. <laughs> I talked to the fridge and he told me where we need to go. So I was both right and wrong because we need to go on the floor below but uh, we need to backtrack to be able to proceed and also I'm not so convinced about uh, do we want to do the fight? well, do we want to attempt the fight? because if you think about it uh, we don't have a lot of practice uh, on the duo, or both of them. Um. And I don't think we'll have too much trouble. And that's uh, a scary concept. Like to make one of the hardest uh, bosses of the game trivialized. Mm. I still think we'll take like 20 attempts or so. Because even though we can, it doesn't mean we should. Also, I don't think we have been here on the first run. I have no memory of this place, like Gandalf. Oh god. Also, apparently... These models uh, are actually ladies uh, under the armor. Ooh. But like, do we want to kill them already? We just got here. We just got here. Can see. How is this grace even called? The transept? <sighs> like it's there. It's right there. <laughs> oh 
Also, I just realized that we passed uh, in front of a uh, golden bow like three times uh, and we didn't grab it. It was here at the abandoned shack. So maybe we could go collect it uh, and then... Wow, we really don't have any checkpoint unlocked in Altus Plato. This is difficult. <laughs> Emotionally. Yeah, no wonder this is the only checkpoint available. So it's a uh, right... Uh... No? It's down, then right under the bridge, and then full ahead. And we need 69 to level up. Oh yeah, under the bridge. After a few hours the game starts to be a little laggy. So if it crashes, a uh, good riddance. I was thinking we could uh, give a couple of attempts uh, just to test out the waters. Uh. Mm. But I feel bad. There was supposed to be a checkpoint nearby this bridge. How didn't we get it? Like, I'm pretty sure we have been here in this run. So what happened? Yeah, there is the... the crazy... Maiden. But we need to go to the village. Which we also missed somehow. Thank you, Anastasia, for wasting our time. Oh, I didn't see her. the dogs
she was protecting the golden bow and doing a pretty good job at it. Also, Afro, have you seen Melania? What do you think of her? Mm. In the arena? No, no, I'm talking about a boss of the game. 44. 44 is still not enough uh, to tank whatever she is going on. Also, I need to memorize Golden Vow. No? But I'm curious now about the character with four arms. So that's such a peculiar number. We can go visit her now, but first... Uh, what do I replace with Golden Vow? Can I use Golden Vow? Hold on. 25 faith? Oh, Rani. Rani is not a boss. We can... We can't use Golden Vault. What a scam. <laughs> oh. Also, hi, Amaletto. How are you doing? We were thinking to pay a visit to Melania just for fancy. So I don't have the faith for Golden Vault. And I think we are also pretty far from 25. Yeah. Oh, well. Because now we got two options. So. Melania or the Godskin Duo. <laughs> Which are both my favorite bosses that I don't want to kill. Also, why did I put... Uh, we already did Mog in the sewers. Nice. <laughs> I'm glad you're doing good. Um, Also, please, game, don't crash. Every time going from Altus Plateau to the Halig Tree... Okay. Uh, we need to change a few things <laughs> in the build. <laughs> so we need the, the bubble at the cost of a few little damage. We need 10 flasks. To heal, we need Joshua and uh, uh, and like the first phase is so easy. The second phase one shots me the moment it starts, so I need to figure out uh, something to avoid it. Hi, Millennium. in the <laughs> if you get stunned once it's really difficult to like fully dodge it but we did it once before so you know I can dodge it if I don't get stunned <laughs> and that's enough for me okay keep the distance
We did it once uh, in the melee run with the God Skin Peeler. So I know it's doable and I know how to do it. It's just that we had uh, a lot more vitality than we do now. So we keep getting one shot in second phase. drink in the meanwhile. <laughs> also her voice is beautiful. Start spamming square. We survived. There is a chance. The chance just died. I dodged. I pressed the button a little too long and it didn't do what it had to do. <laughs> but like it's super doable, I just... Uh, I lose focus. <laughs> Joshua, you need to not die. Can you do it for me? Can you be a good boy and not die in the second phase? about to do the thing. Hmm. 
I wanted to try to heal him. How do I do that? Alright, I have them on the right trigger. Also, it doesn't heal a lot. How do I protect my body? Maybe if I enter the arena without being two-handed he will heal a little more often. He can do it. No, I can't do it though. Maybe instead of health we should have prioritized the uh, stamina. Maybe. Also, what do you think? After millennia, can we go mess with the god skins? <laughs> I will be really tempted. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Double buff. She's avoiding everything. Oh, thank you, Joshua. try to use the hmm. oh we died at the same time maybe we could try because if I enter the battle with the sword uh, Fake Joshua will keep the sword, but I will have a different weapon. Hmm. It's worth to try. But then I need uh, a more balanced uh, flask management. Hmm. I mean, sure. Okay, Joshua, this is the plan. You go in with the sword, I go in with the stick. And maybe select a spell, a sorcery. Oh, I can still stun. Uh oh Ah, 
Uh, almost. Uh, I got stuck in the wall. You need to press dodge when she's mid-air. So you go in and you don't get hit. But if there is a wall, you roll in the wall and uh, you get less frames. I'm so pet peeved about arenas uh, that are uncomfortable to fight in. In this arena, with all these stupid branches, Yeah, I was about to say Joshua will not survive. Maybe we both need to be sticks. She doesn't even dodge. to survive and um, now what but I don't want to win without fake Joshua it was all victory uh oh I actually never seen this attack. Okay, bye. She never did that attack to me. Did she summon multiple versions of herself? Uh, okay, let's try double stick. But Joshua, you need to use the rock sling. Maybe if I remove all of the other stupid spells. Because he's gonna use the comets. I know that fake Joshua loves the comets, but they don't work on her. We need physical damage. I mean, this can stay. This, not good for her. Uh, because I know, I know that fake Joshua will use some stupid spell otherwise. I'm not going to duplicate the runes so if we win. It's too stressful. Stop casting healing, Joshua! <laughs> if you keep healing, you're not gonna do damage. I think the AI is really bugged. 
like really really bugged yeah try to guess which spell do you need to use joshua it's a hint you only have one better when we had uh, the sword because she doesn't get stunned uh, otherwise Okay, that's, uh, that's enough messing around for now. Melania needs a, a very specific uh, mindset uh, that I don't have. Uh, but at least we can survive the nuke. Okay, what did we have? Simple... No, it was pebble. Comet, then cure, mean healings, then rocks, and uh, another comet. I would have loved to put golden bow over here, but we don't have uh, the face requirements. I mean, it can't stay empty. Hmm? Yeah, I still don't understand what this means. Purifies the Lords of Blood Cursed. What does it mean? Obviously, it has something to do with Mog. I've tried to read the description, but it doesn't add uh, any information. Mm. Actually, I need a bit more flasks. believe we are actually going to them. Uh, it's been so long. We are gonna use the back entrance on the second attempt. <laughs> or I mean we could uh, just for the fancies. Uh, I want to take a last uh, peek uh, 
at the arena from the top. Yeah, that is going to be us in a second. Every time the temptation to just jump down from here is very strong uh, and it will still not be enough to trigger the, the boss fight because they let you wander a bit in if you enter from the basic entrances but what if you enter from... from... <laughs> from here <laughs> What is that? Also, where is the summoning pool? Wait, I didn't see it. There is always a, a summoning pool nearby the boss fight. Odd. Also, I feel like this is not even the right entrance either. <laughs> Bernard? Yeah. No, no. <laughs> like it's so close to the spawning points. And that's the exit. I don't feel ready. <laughs> I don't feel ready at all. Uh. Mm. I think uh, it's either gonna go very well <laughs> or it's gonna go very bad. Also, I don't need the better sorceries uh, talisman for this fight. So. Mm, what could I use instead? Right, the one, the one that I don't have because we don't, we didn't go to Volcano Manor. The one that gives extra damage when you do parries. So. Forgot about that. Well, I didn't forget. We didn't kill the boss that guarded it. It's different. So we need something for. No. I'm trying to convince myself to enter the arena, but... Uh, <laughs> Can I have a normal talisman? Something very basic. Sure. Okay, let's give it our best.
Hmm. Hi, Igor. Look at all these non parryable attacks. I know that on the second attempt <laughs> we are gonna receive a flame to the face the moment we enter the arena. I just know. <laughs> I'm not taking this seriously enough. <laughs> In this fight, everything counts. It's like the Khalid Tower. No rules apply in this room. There's something wrong with that attack. Maybe I'm too far. Oh, okay. I need to be closer then. Unfortunate.
the way that they come over there to look like, oh, is he dead? <laughs> yeah, fake Joshua is gonna make things worse <laughs> in this fight. I almost hit the wrong button. <laughs> Can you stop being adorable for two seconds? <laughs> Keeps doing funny stuff in the background. stuttering in this arena. That does a lot of damage. moment to finish a buff. Okay, easy one. so desperately to get them to second phase and he just wouldn't. He didn't want to die. Which is fair enough, but still. No, no fire.
Second phase, please. Thank you. That will be funny. It's really difficult to switch between one and two hands. Maybe I could buff outside. Explain to me how did the fire go? <laughs> it went through him. Like they can body block each other, but the fire doesn't count. <laughs> See, he doesn't throw the fire at me because he he's nice. He waits for me to be undercover. to pay the extra oh. second phase please bello che sei
From 1 to 10, how bad of an idea is having both of them in second phase? No, baby, don't! Don't! He doesn't keep the distance in the second place. Amazing. my buff expire always at the worst times. So. Okay, don't panic heal, we got this. fun to have both of them in second phase <laughs> but it's hmm. 
It's taking a toll. Yeah, I don't really get uh, the kind of games that you need to pay them to be able to play them. Like maybe I'm old school, but I preferred when you got uh, like a physical box, you had your game and that was it. Very PlayStation 2 style. My buff ended right before the parry. Wow. He went around. He was smart enough to go around. <laughs> Try to explain that. Okay. Hmm. The noble <laughs> went AFK for a second. I just wanted to listen to the music for a little longer. Can we have a pretty fight for once? Noble doing. Oh. <sighs> I 
forgot he's made of paper. Now I have a very angry sheet of paper <laughs> in this room. <laughs> You don't roll backwards to avoid the flames. After getting robbed of two parries because I was on the tombstone and he wasn't, uh, The most uh, unlucky series of events. second phase for you. No second phase for you either, then. Okay. I'm sorry for bullying your friend uh, into not going in second phase.
Oh, it's because of the eyes. Ooh. I feel like there is something missing in our build, but I can't uh, pinpoint what it is. There is like a, a tiny bit of damage missing. Uh, and I don't know if it's from the statistics uh, or from the items. Uh. I prefer to have the double heal instead uh, of the regeneration and a little bit of more damage in the flask. Like, they really went for it. <laughs>
Yeah, it's record or record. Also, hi Chris, how are you doing? I'm trying to do a very specific thing and it's not happening. <laughs> I want the baby to go in second phase when the other is also in second phase. Oh, it's alright. We are just messing around a bit. attacks in a row. Maybe I should have just launched uh, a comet to him. Also, yeah, let's take a sip. We can also start to think about what to do next uh, as the bosses, uh, because after we get past them, there is gonna be the dragon, and uh, Malikath, we can go back to Melania at any point, uh, but uh, we need more damage output. Also, for defenses, we could uh, summon fake Joshua to see. To see. But I'm afraid uh, that he will perform too well. He's fully upgraded. So he might be stupid, but uh, he's strong. Identical to the original. If you press any button while you are entering, he does the fireball, otherwise not.
that is completely normal and was supposed to happen. Also, technically, if I send him in the second phase uh, first, uh, he will stay in second phase forever, right? Yeah, but the song doesn't trigger. I didn't expect to do that much damage. I didn't jump. He still got over the pill. <laughs>
he saved you. I'm not even paying attention to the music because it's so difficult to deal with both of them in second phase. But it also makes it more exciting. Did you get awkward again, Afro? And then you were like, no, that's the last time I gamble. <laughs> Why do I lock on to him immediately? Don't, don't, do not, their button. He's so dramatic. <laughs> mm. You need to call your friend.
I was thinking about the refrain. <laughs> I haven't uh, sung that song in a very long while. Lately I've been very into Bad Apple. It's very mood. The, the text of the song. In the second part of the fight there is my favorite uh, line. If we can get there, maybe. The song uh, is in Latinorum, which is uh, a Latin that sounds nice but is grammarly incorrect. Then it got translated to English and I like it more in Italian. attacking neither because they are too close I need to buff unfortunate might kill him. You don't have that range, come on. For some reason he didn't want to go in second phase, he needed a little nudge. Also high small snake. Surprise tornado. Please survive the refrain. No, I'm not gonna survive the refrain. Maybe? doing the refrain <laughs> I was like oh yeah I'm safe and then the baby <laughs> mm -hmm. oh yeah finding the perfect reference is not easy also hi Maji
<sighs> I don't even remember how the first part goes. Uh, Nostra Madre Nostra Madre Oscurati dall'albero E esclusi dalla tua grazia Odio la grazia Invidio la grazia Imperatore Retico Donami il tuo vigore E, e arrivederci e grazie prefer the Italian version over both Latinum and uh, English. But what else? What else? Oh, now they are shinier than ever. Mm. No, I wanted to buff. Can I survive until the refrain? <laughs> Maybe. What is this low mo? No, thank you. I want to buff again. He always goes in second phase in the refrain. What is that? What is that bullshit? Ah.
Le tue vesti mi dan vigore per combattere a fianco a te queste vesti che mi appartengono a me soltanto a me You know, we could easily win now. wasn't meant to happen. Oh! Peculiar. At least this gives us uh, an opportunity to... Oh, the frame rate is gone. <laughs> what is this slow-mo? The frame rate is gone. <laughs> hmm. I almost consider the finishing the fight uh, so that the next time we can go exploring the rest of Aramazula but something tells me that uh, the boss uh, that we didn't do that I still need to figure out uh, is not uh, in the first half it has to be in the second half There is two in here. Or not? Mm, we need to think as strata to defeat Melania. <laughs> the double swords one was pretty cool. We tried the rocks, it didn't work. What could we try instead? Oh, this is a glow worth, isn't it? which we do not need. Really? Ice is a weakness? 
of hers. Well then, it's pretty lucky that we have the greatsword then. I'm used to do her with the peeler, but that will mean that we need to kill an innocent. And I don't want to do that. Back to Bellidia. So we need to change the things again. For the explosion. And hope that Joshua does what he needs to do. I don't have Joshua! I also have the wrong talismans. No. Resist, Joshua, resist! I need to take the aggro. Uh oh. There is other ways to take the aggro. <laughs> Because the thing is, we need uh, both uh, to survive. Maybe this I can keep. Actually, it's not that bad of a build. Uh, but the extra runes... The pocket money... Oh, we are not doing this for the runes, we are doing it for the great rune. Which we didn't get to use in the previous run. Joshua, wait for me. She's gonna do it. <laughs> oh 
yeah, ice is pretty cool. Oh, we got so close, we both survived the first phase. It's so doable. Another couple of tries. And we do it. <laughs> A lot of people prefer ice over summer. I need to keep some distance. Good job. <laughs> With a sword. <laughs> Flask. No, Joshua, let me take the aggro. What is that? Okay, this time don't enter whatever that is. Oh. Ash. The moment Joshua dies, both of them die. It's a single life uh, splitting two bodies. Need to cover for him a little more. I was not ready. <laughs> I was too busy protecting him that uh, it didn't work. I wanted to go for the parry and it didn't work and I got demoralized. <laughs> hmm. Wow. <laughs> that sounds pretty dope. <laughs> yeah, no pressure. <laughs> The pressure is on Melania. She needs to keep up with two Joshuas. He's too busy buffing. She gets stunned. Uh, we haven't been using the moonlight long enough to know how many hits we need. But usually it cho choose lashes and one hit. Why didn't it proc?
Oh, she coming. They need to be consecutive. So yours. And a little bit of mine. He already had less than half a life. If only we had the peeler. It's going slowly, but it's going. The loading screen. <laughs> okay, it stopped. So that means it crashed. It tried its best. I oh, know. I can still change the suggestions so it's not crashed. But it's not going forward. <laughs> At least we can read a lot of uh, suggestions. When you level up, you can spend runes to increase your attributes. As your attributes increase, your level rise. And so does the amount of runes required for your next attribute increase. Spirits that you have summoned from ashes can be made more powerful by a spirit turner. You'll need glow worth to upgrade spirits. Infinite suggestions. While in combat, you are unable to craft items or open up your map. You cannot enter large buildings, caves, catacombs, or similar spaces while on horse. You can also cannot summon your horse while inside such spaces. I don't think anyone has ever seen this many suggestions in a row. <laughs> Use your map to check. I mean, purgatory. Nothing is happening. <laughs> Melania put us in timeout. What am I supposed to do? If I make the game crash, isn't it worse? Do I need to call task manager? I think we might. But to be honest, it's the first uh, self-induced crash. Poor baby. Okay, let it reboot. I'm not done with Melania. I I feel so close that. Uh, in half an hour, we can get her. This, though, is a bit of a distraction, I have to say. The crash was not uh, expected. And lately, I've been feeling it crashes more and more often. Like, the very first one that we got uh, was against uh, the dragon in the Limgrave Lake. Agil, yeah. Agil was the first to make the game crash, but not the only one. And we are back.
I was on the ground. <laughs> I need to think of a of a strategy. Also, maybe we can use a, an item or two. I'm I'm a bit. Uh, I'm sure if I want to use the, the runes, uh, I mean, we could use one in a few items. So. If we get close again, I'm gonna use one. Joshua, do the bodyguard. She can do the one-shot attack any moment now. And she still chose me. This is why I don't want to use the rune. <laughs> Although it might help. Oh, I didn't mean to debug. I pressed the wrong button. She's yours. I need to take my leave. Oh, she wants me. She wants only me. Maybe I need to de-lock her and actually run away. Otherwise I don't gain enough uh, distance. Also, I find it lovely that uh, Joshua can only tank uh, the whirlwind and I can only tank the explosion and vice versa. We took too long. I shouldn't rely only on the long range, but mix in a little more normal attacks to protect him. 
after she does the water flow. that too. We can try that. tried. <laughs> Maybe if she if she was hit once more we could have done it. Joshua is the dog. <laughs> you can only summon once. I need to determine if I have to be scared of uh, the water flow or not.
This fight is on us. <laughs> we died at the same time. <laughs> I feel like it's better to spend uh, the great runes instead of the meat uh, because that's harder to obtain and I don't have the crafting for it. Stamina, stamina, ugh. We need a lot more stamina. Uh, we don't have the turtle talisman, sadly. Also, the first time I did it without rune. Yeah, amazing time to buff Joshua. <laughs> what a silly man. If he didn't buff her, we will last unlock her, I believe. But he's a bit of a dummy. get under 70% that fast? Or did we? We weren't even focusing on her. Hmm. After we are done with her, I really want to draw something to decompress. Also, I don't like to fight uh, close to the lake because the map is really dark. If we stay close to the entrance, at, the, at least there is the light of the gate. Joshua doesn't care about lightning.
Okay. That felt very anime. <laughs> Going after him and then me. While being covered in literal snowflakes. I forgot it has a three combo attack. <laughs> okay, so it's a one, two, and three. Three attacks. Kind of like Maria.
She never did that attack once in the first run, and now she did twice today. I have no idea how. Like, uh, dodge uh, forward the first one, dodge left uh, the second one, and the third one is definitely not forward. Okay. Did we took too long and the buff uh, expired? I thought we were attacking fast enough. Not fast enough.
Okay, we have seen it three times today. Uh, if only we had the peeler, god damn. But I don't want to kill the baby in this run. We never tried... Uh... Very unlucky attack. She could have done anything but that. The other one would have wouldn't have survived anyway. I wonder if Terra Magica works uh, on the moonlight. Uh. Mm. 
I don't even know which one is the icon. <laughs> it has to be blue. This is so dumb. This is so, so dumb. second phase I'm terribly trying to stun her, but it doesn't happen. And I don't know why. Yeah, we should have probably went to a faith build again. Oh yeah, it, the ending was totally worth it. We need the achievement. The thing is, I keep thinking about uh, the God Skin Pillar. That would have solved all of our problems, <laughs> like in an instant. But we don't have it.
I'm collecting a few ideas as we go that require item finding. Yeah, we need a few more crafting materials. So. The path of evil. We would have punished uh, regardless because of our build. Like build and ending are not correlated. I wish. I wish. Let's go buy some rocks. Still not talking to him. Okay, so we have... Uh, 28, uh, just fine. 15. We need uh, 10, level 3. 6, uh, level 4. 1, level 5. And a bunch of 7s. So and these two will have to be found naturally, which is not ideal. Maybe in Farumazua there is a few. You can guess who's the character that has the the bell that allows you to buy those kind of rocks. That's a high shadow trap. How are you doing? So we said uh, 10 level 3s. 6 level 4s. <laughs> that sounds nice. I usually don't uh, listen to ASMR, but there is people who like it. Um, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. <laughs> and now we need the 7s. <laughs> Nice Wally, putting us to sleep kindly, gently. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, for the next time, ask permission to pass a link, so just in case. Otherwise, it can come off a little bushy. Also, what's wrong, Roderica? Why are you here? Take a look around. Don't worry. I don't blame you. I'll continue spirit tuning just the same as before, which is why I need your help. His roots are so knotted in this place. He won't last much longer if he stays here. His shackles are broken. It's high time he put the round table behind him. Okay, so she now stands there. 
Okay. <laughs> oh well, we are getting closer to eight and a half, uh, and uh, it's been five hours. Uh, But I still think we did something. Uh, like, uh, I know that we didn't beat Melania or the Godskin Duo. The Godskin Duo for a different reason. Because I want to keep playing against them in the weekend. Uh, so on Thursday we can go forth uh, like trains. Uh, Melania I would have wished we could have beaten her, but uh, our statistics are kind of low. At least we got pretty eyes and a burnt hand arm. Uh, if only we could have gotten golden bow to work, but it said it required 25 faith. 25! That's like 13 levels! Which you can do in an instant in uh, the Halic tree. But I don't want to do it alive. I'm gonna put uh, Golden Vow in the incantation spell. In the hope that we'll be able to use it. 25 faith. 25 faith! Can you believe? Also, how can all of our spells uh, occupy one slot? And yet we have so few. I thought we explored all of the um, towers that gave them. We had like 14 in the first run. Odd. Oh, we don't really need bestial energy though. Vitality. In the exchange of what? Okay, let's do a quick recap so that we have an idea of what to do ne the next time. Beating Melania is optional. We can do it to have fun with her. The next time we must defeat the Godskin duo so we can get past them and look for Placidus Axe which uh, I still have no idea where he is, uh, and I want to figure it out on my own. Although, while we were messing around to find the second entrance, uh, I noticed uh, a bridge that leads uh, to the tornado, so it would make sense if the entrance was uh, nearby. Like, you get on the bridge, uh, and then there is a prompt that brings you in the heart of the tornado. Or at least that's what the talisman said. And uh, mm, if we manage to find and defeat the dragon, that's uh, the second to last uh, achievement to unlock. Then we get the frenzy ending. Then we get uh, the common ending if you don't do any quest. Which uh, it's quite ironical that it's the last one we are gonna get. And then we wait for the DLC. But uh, for today, I think uh, we played enough Elden Ring.